So people, I've seen quite a lot of hype over the past week about Pokemon cards, people collecting them, people showcasing them, and I thought to myself, well, I've got a decent Pokemon card collection. I mean, I haven't had this out of the cupboard in about two or three years. I mean, I posted a video on Twitter the other day. That video was from a few years back. I mean, I got a little bit of excitement around these cards. I mean, about 10 years ago, maybe, I started collecting them just as I was getting into YouTube. I just started waste. Well, I thought at the time I was wasting money on cards that were never going to be worth anything. I mean, these have not been graded by absolutely anybody, but everything I was buying was basically brand new or A grade. As soon as I got them, I just put them in a sleeve and put them in this folder. And I've got a couple of folders, but I think this is probably the main one. I mean, I know I've got a couple of first collections elsewhere that are in like hard sleeves, but I just don't know what anything's worth, people. So I'm hoping you guys can help me out, considering I've just lost track of absolutely everything. Now, I know back when I started collecting, I was collecting anything that was shiny, anything I didn't have, anything that looked good, anything that was rare or said to be rare. Error cards, the lot. So let's get into what I've got, people, and hopefully you can help me out and see well, at least explain to me or let me know what some of these are worth. Now, I apologise about my camera. It's a bit dodgy because I'm using a Crane M2 and it's all over the place. It's got a mind of its own. But, okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, my Team Rocket folder. Now, this is dusty as heck. Okay, so that's the first page. Now, I like to organise things in terms of, like, individual Pokemons. I'm not sure. Like I said, I don't know what's worth what. Charizard EX. I've got some Japanese one there. I've got another one. I think that's Blaine's Charizard there. There's, like, a gym leader one. I got Charizards here, I got Charizards there. I just, like I said, I remember at the time some of these been worth quite a lot of money, but I just don't know what's worth what, people. So I'm hoping you can help me out. Um, more here. Dark Charizard, I don't know who's that. Is that, I don't know, is that Brock? I can't remember people, I honestly can't remember. It's been so long since I've even looked at these, I ain't really said, I know this one here, your Shining Charizard. I think that's worth a bit of money, but I just don't know what. I mean, that's a Japanese Shining Mew. I've got Shining Mewtwo. I've got Shining Raichu. Celebi, is that how that's pronounced? I don't even know. Steelix. Um, Butops. I mean, people. It's crazy. It's crazy. Shining Godos. Come on, people. And like, like I said, all of these are in, well, basically perfect condition. I've got a Shining Magic First Edition. I just don't even know. And some of these might be rare cards as well. Not rare cards, sorry, um, like error cards. This crane has literally got a mind of its own. It's just turning by itself. I apologise about that, people. Uh, Mewtwo's. I mean, yeah. Like I said, I'm hoping you guys can help me out. I don't know what that means there with winner and best. And it's full shining. Yeah, like I said, I remember back in the day when I was in school. Man, I'm like 30 odd now, but back when I was in school, Pokemon cards were crazy. Really crazy. And now... It seems to be like, well, they never really died down, but at the minute, it seems everyone's just going mad about them. And like I said, I went through a stage of just buying everything I could see. Everything I didn't have. I don't, well, I've got two Mews there. Why are they different? Mew EX. Another Mew EX. That one's signed or something. Um, but yeah, these are perfect. I haven't sent any off to be graded. People said to me, you should get these graded. I'm like, I'm too scared to send them to be graded. If someone scratches one of these. I mean, like I said, I just—you don't know. Who, I don't know anything about them, so I don't know who to trust uh, or anything. Let me just move my folder a bit closer to my mic because you probably can't hear me. So I've got Celebi EX there, whatever that means. I mean, EX cars, I think, were the ones that were like the newest when I stopped collecting them. Anything after that, like all these newer ones that have come out, I, I, I ain't collected any of them. Bit of Blastoise here. So yeah, quite quite a few, quite a few. This folder's, I mean, there's, excuse my beautiful looking feet. Anybody who's got foot fetishes. But yeah, like I said, this folder's rammed full. There's only one of a few folders I've got. And I've got, like I said, I've got a, a shoebox as well, but in the shoebox it's like hard. Well, ones I brought like are graded ones, but I don't think there's anything great there. That was from the movie. Do you remember the movie? The first one, back, back, back in the day, I think that was. Wow. I mean, looking at these now, man, they bring back so many memories. And <laughs> the amount of money I spent, people, unbelievable. Pikachus, now I remember these like surfing Pikachus and all these kind of ones. People were going mad over, so I thought, yeah, I'll get them, why not? 
It's a full hollow card. I don't know what that means in terms of rarity or anything anymore. Just can't, can't remember. We've got this one here. I'll come back to that in a second. We've got Birthday Pikachu there. It's got a weird symbol on it. I don't know what that means. Another Birthday Pikachu there. Um, I've got... Some of these are error cards, like I said, that's why they're here, because they're error cards. I know these ain't looking anything special, but... I mean, that's the same card there as there, but... I oh, that one's shiny, I just realised. Yeah, there's definitely error cards in here. I don't know what's what. But hey, um... Now, let's go back to this one, yeah? This one at the time, I remember seeing, is Ash's Pikachu. Now, obviously, everyone knows Ash, and everyone knows Ash's Pikachu, but... This was one of a few I'd ever seen in my life. It's Ash's Pikachu, I don't even know what that card is, I don't know where it's from, what set it's from. Uh, and if it says promo, but I ain't got a clue. I've looked on the internet, well I looked on the internet quite a while back, couldn't find really anything on it. And then we've got this one right here, I think it's called like Izanagi's or Izazuri's or Iga something something's Pikachu, which is like a drawn card. It's a legit card by the way, it's not like something's made up, but yeah, don't know anything much about it. More Pikachus here. Then we've got Raichu, Lieutenant Surge's man. We've got Dark Raichu, another Dark Raichu, Pre-release Raichu. I mean, like I said, guys, I'm hoping you can help me out. I'm really hoping you can help me out. We've got more Raichus here. I remember one of these I looked for for a long time was an error card one, and it's supposed to be the rarest card ever. It was an error card. Is that a, is it classed as a jungle? I think it's jungle, I don't know. But one of them error card was supposed to be the rarest card ever. I couldn't find that. I've got a first edition one though. That's in perfect condition. I don't know what's that worth. Like I said, there's quite a few here, people. And like I said, I'm hoping you guys can help me out. I mean, not even like a quarter of the way through this folder. It's how mad I went. I just went absolutely mad. Now, if you guys um, know of the rarest cards, you know what the rarest cards are, just let me know down below in that comment section, please, because i probably got it lying around somewhere, or if you've seen one that you think is pretty rare, let me know. I mean, if you can't get a hold of me on my YouTube, join my Twitter link below, follow me on Twitter, PayPal, or join my Discord. Uh, hit me up at IVLM, and you're guaranteed to get a response. Now, Gyarados. Giovanni's Gyarados. That Misty's Gyarados, Japanese. Got this one here, which is a... Uh, pretty colours. I got Dark Gyarados pre-release, I got Dark Gyarados Japanese, I got another Gyarados, I got, I got Deoxys, I don't know what that means either. Man, people, it's just crazy. It's just crazy! Let me just go on, what is that? That's pretty cool. So I ain't seen these in years, so some of these look new to me, even though I've seen them before. What I do was, what I do was back in the day, I'd go on eBay, and I'd search for people that had like, got whole collections that were in perfect condition, I'd just buy the whole collection. So I mean, I got so many duplicates as well. A couple of the old folders I got are just pure duplicates. And it's like when I stopped collecting them, I think it was like this was from 151 to 250, these kind of Pokemons. I don't even know any of their names. That's how long it's been. Don't watch Pokemon no more. Haven't watched it in years. I don't know what that one is. For Alligator. Yeah, I remember the name. I remember the name now. Yeah, man, people. I'm hoping you can help me out. Got a pre-release Misty's Seedra there. Pre-release one of whatever that is. I don't know. Emerald something here. Crazy. Crazy. Like I said, this is just going. It's going on. There's so many cards here, guys. This video is already ten minutes long, almost. I mean, I've had a couple of uh, offers since that video I posted on Twitter. A few days back for well like I said that video I recorded a long time ago but I've had a few offers since that but I just don't know what's worth what I could sell a card I don't know I sell a card for 20 pound next thing I know it's on eBay 200 pound I'm like well I just got scammed that's why I'm just wary of sending them off I'm wary of selling any of them I'm wary of doing anything because I just don't know what any of them are worth These were the evolved, well, they were the evolved Eevees. I remember, I remember that. Everyone remembers Eevee. Everyone remembers Eevee. But the base set, yeah, all of them, but from 1 to 150. I remember, guys, back in the day, 
I could go from 1 to 151 in perfect order. That's how mad I was with Pokemon. I was super mad. I remember that as well. When that always first edition, I think it was. I'm a chump. I'm a chump. Uh, but yeah, guys, I mean, like I said, this fold is just mad. I don't want to skip through it because I'm scared I might miss something and one of you guys are like, yeah, look at that. Or come to this video looking for a certain card that I've got. So I don't know what that is. I think that might be a fake card. Because I've never seen a full hologram of that kind of Nidal Queen. But it's got a weird symbol there. See that? I don't know what that symbol is. But I've never seen it before. I think they were a jungle set. Could it be a re-release jungle set? I don't know. I don't know. Nidal King. There's just so many guys. I don't know. I don't know what's worth what. Great looking card. Is that a Japanese like dark? Ma what was it called? Ma Magnet. No, it's there. It says it right there. Magneton. Team Rockets, maybe? Dark? I don't know. Oh, yeah, it's dark. It's right. It's right next to it. I'm looking at this through the camera. I'm not looking at the folder. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Like I said, you tell me, people. You tell me what you think these are worth or the collection's worth or if the collection's even any good. Because I don't know. It could be bad. I mean, I've just been sitting on it for a long time. I remember that though. So you said, I chased that car for so long when I was a kid. Like my, the, the cars I had when I was a kid were okay. But obviously, you, you're running around with your school friends, you're passing them about, they're looking at them, and they get damaged so quickly. So, like, all my childhood cards are. Uh, I've probably still got them somewhere, but. Ooh, that's a pretty one. Like, I've probably still got them somewhere, but I have no idea where they are. That's the first edition as well. I think first editions are worth a bit more, I think, I'm guessing. You know, I'm guessing they are. First edition, you know. You know how it goes. It's another one there. Dark Sloking. This one here looks a bit weird. Japanese Psyduck. Is that Bowsprout? I remember some of the names. I'm not, I'm not that bad. I'm not that bad, people. Halfway through, well, just past halfway through. <laughs> like I said, it's just crazy. I don't think the, I don't, like I said, I ordered them in, I didn't order them with sets apart from the Shining ones. And I just ordered them with the actual certain Pokemon. Now, not one stage I had all sets of like the first, the base, the jungle and fossil. I definitely had all of them. But, like I said, uh, I'm just looking at. See if I can see anything that I thought. Yeah, at the time when I brought them, that this that was rare. Gotta get that. Crystals and Guardians. Or Crystal Guard. EX. Whatever. Whatever that means. Whatever that means. And that's why there's so many spaces because I ordered them with the actual Pokemon that they are. The Oxys sounds like a sick name. Hitman Chan Hitman Lee. I've actually got as well, big cards, like bigger cards, like they were massive, I saw them and I think I bought them off eBay a long time ago, I'm thinking, why are they so big? I've got to get myself one of them. And I got this here, which I don't even, let me move that blanket out of the way, I don't even know what that is, but I thought I've got to get that. What's his name? Hypno, Dark Hypno, Wicked. Mr. Mime and Ditto. Ditto. Great Pokemon. I hope my camera back should not die. I've never even heard of that Pokemon before. Absol. Absol. So yeah, this has been this this folder has been sitting at the back of my cupboard, which I game on. So like no one can go, get to it. It's just behind me. You gotta get to my cards, you gotta get through me, people. But yeah, it's been sitting there and there's like, like, there's like dust everywhere, and you can't see it, but there's dust everywhere. But every single one of these cards is in its own little separate plastic folder right inside this. Because I just didn't want them getting touched. Now, what are these ones? These have all got the same symbol. The mute there. Oh, yes, yeah, so I put it as the images. 
fit together see that's what it was see Pidgeot's wing and onyx and then Mew's wing well Mew and the wing of Pidgeot we've got a couple more like that I'm guessing that would have been a setup I think probably brand new probably brand new oh just hit my camera on my mic Starmie like these were all, like, that's the first edition. Pretty cool, pretty, pretty cool, people. Pretty cool. Like, I could be, I could be sitting on a, a fortune here. For, I know, at the time when I bought these, and many, many years ago, I did pay a lot of money for, well, I say a lot of money, but it's obviously not a lot of money nowadays. But for certain cards, I think you could pay like 50, 80 pound, 100 pound maybe. I think that Shining Charizard I paid about 100 pound for. I think, I think. I probably got ripped off, but I never at the time I wanted it because it was one of the only Charizards at the time I didn't have. So I had to get it. Now there's hundreds of Charizards I'm seeing. And Charizard always seems to be the rarest. I don't know why. I mean, obviously Charizard's an icon. He's iconic. Same as Pikachu. But you would have think someone like Mewtwo or Mew would be the rarest. Considering they are, well, are they still the most powerful? I remember Mewtwo used to be the most powerful. Back in the days of going to the cinemas when I'm about 17, 16, well, 17. Makes me look like a big kid, but yeah. When I went to the cinemas and watched that film, the original film, pretty cool. I watched the one on Netflix too. It's like, a, is it like a remake or? But Mewtwo's like made out to be a baddie, but it's actually a goodie. It's pretty cool. Recommend that, people. Watch that 30 year old man sitting down watching that with a bit of popcorn. You know what I'm saying? Steelix there. That's a weird one. Uh, Promo Meowth. Could all Meowth speak, or was it the only the Team Rocket's Meowth? I can't remember. Uh, Crystal Guardians, whatever that means. But yeah, guys, if there's a specific card you're looking for that I might have, or you think there's a specific card you've seen online that someone else has covered that's super rare or whatever, if there's an error card coming up, I do remember at the time, I've always looking for error cards. I've searched for, for months looking for certain error cards because I'd go on the internet and I'd think, what are those error cards? What are they? And I'd search for them and I'd find them and I'd buy them. I know I've got error card Pikachus. I've got this and your, oh, what are these? These are all like the energy cards and things like that. Now we are coming to the back of this now. Trainer cards, people. Now there was a rare trainer card as well, I can't remember what it was called. I've got even more, yeah. Oh, these could be a bit of duplicates as well. Yeah, that's what these are, guys. These are duplicates, I think. I think. Uh, yeah, I think they are. They all look the same to me now. All these cards are starting to look the same to me. And that's the end of the folder, I think. And this last page is stuck to something. Oh, this could be the big card I've got. Let me move that. Oh, this is one of the big cards I've got. Oh, look at these. One more spares. Now, I've got two of these. I know they were different, but I don't remember why or what. But I remember there was two at the time. And it, you got it with the release of the movie, I think. But there was two different versions. One was ultra rare, and I think I've got both. So, yeah. So there's that big card. I mean, look at the size of that. And I got a couple of them. I don't know where they all are, and I don't know what these are either. And I don't know what that is. Well, I have no idea what that is. But it's a card in there. I don't want to take it out of it. And what's in these then? Oh, these are them, that collection of uh, the Mute and the Pidgeot and the Onyx. That's what them are. But yeah, guys, those are my Pokemon cards. So yeah. If there's anything here you think's worth anything, or do you think this is a decent collection? Do let me know, guys. The video has been on for 20 minutes. I've been sitting here recording this. 20 minutes! Before I get it done in about five. But yeah, guys, let me know what you think. That's my baby though. Shining Charles, I love that card for some reason. I don't know why. But yeah, guys, let me know down below. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you can help me out. If you enjoyed the video, not something I normally do. I don't really post about Pokemon cards, it's normally gaming, Destiny, Borderlands, Cyberpunk. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know if you have got any clue about anything I've showed you. 
I would appreciate that. Like I said, hit me up on Discord, hit me up on Twitter, hit me up anywhere. Hopefully I get a message. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully I will see you on that next one.